I guess happiness has to do with how you get through the day. So the notion of time is something that's very important to me. I don't see that we're going anywhere necessarily into the future. I think that there is no future and I think that there's no past. I think there's just an eternal present and that we live eternally. So I started to make paintings in order to make the present that I could revisit. And I guess one thing that I've never tried to do is make money. And maybe that's good because if I did, the things wouldn't look the same. And I've been lucky enough to have a, an access to this door where I could paint things that have no reason other than the fact that I want to paint them. I look at things and I find that I have a hard time with it, so I have to build my own reality. Uh, I think people try to stop you all the time from making art. Uh, they'll offer you something to make a movie for less money than you could do it for, and then you have to learn how to say no, as much as you have to learn how to say yes. There's two ways of doing something. There's one way of going out into the world and doing something that could be useful in some kind of way. And then there's another way of looking at the world and you look into your corner. And in that corner, you could find something that could open another kind of world for other people if they could kind of look into that corner also. So I think that there are different permutations of life. I do it one foot behind the next, but I do it by myself. I've never tried to uh, produce or, or mass market any of the things that, uh, any of the furniture that I've made or any of those things. It just felt like if I built it a specific way and built it the way that I liked it for myself that it would be okay for somebody else. Thank you.